And something else you should be checking out is, of course, the Liverpool Acoustic Festival. And I'm joined by Festival Director Paul Dunbar. Paul, how's it going? Very, very well. <laughs> uh, everything's now programmed, everything's in. Um, so I am basically responsible for programming the entire thing. Um, whilst also trying to delegate as much work as possible and delegate as much, you know, so I don't get as stressed, really. Um, but it's, you know, it's going really, really well. We've got other partners involved as well. We've got um, a few music promoters like Mellow Tone and Liverpool Acoustic. We've also got Liverpool Live TV involved as well. Um, and basically it's been funded by Liverpool City Council and the Arts Council England as well. Um, Unity Theatre and Liverpool Philharmonic are basically co-partners on it as well. Yeah. So it's definitely grown since the previous two it years. It has, hasn't it? Because it feels like it's this year is like massively big and you're, you said the Philharmonic, you're going to go into the music um, space there yeah. and then you're going to be in Unity Theatre as well. Tell us about some of the lineup you've got this year. Well, the lineup is extremely vast, again, just because of the, the sheer scope of the festival. We've got over like 50 acts at the moment. Wow. Um, but like we've got Tommy Scott, um, we've got, he's doing a duo set with Paul Hemmings. Um, we've got Ian McNabb, Ian Prowse, oh, Robert Vincent, uh, Gary Edward Jones, um, and so on, so on. Um, but we've also got kind of uh, touring national acts at the moment as well, okay. like Marcus Bonfanti, who's yeah. a British blues guitarist, who's incredible, uh, and Scott Matthews as well, who is he's an, uh, he's an award winner of many, many, many awards. So you're, you're bringing a lot of artists here, like you said, touring, but there is that massive focus on it being for Liverpool artists as well, isn't it? Absolutely, and that, that, that was the kind of ethic from the start of the festival of giving Liverpool artists that that platform to kind of showcase their material um, in such an intimate setting, but in a, a beautiful setting such as Unity and the Phil as well. So. Yeah. so tell us when is it and how can people get tickets? It is Friday the 18th and Saturday the 19th of March. You can buy tickets through Liverpool Philharmonic's box office or their website, which is liverpoolphil.com. Can't wait for it, Paul. Thank you so much for chatting to us.